the Greenwood family. And Pilgrim. Where's everyone else? They were attacked. Where are the crystals? Over there. Radio Sophie. Fast. Sophie? I have Carl. He's okay. What about you guys? Sophie? Sophie? Are you there? You have to help the maiden. Where should I go? Tango Motel. Sophie's hideout is there. Run. Fast. I can't believe I let them fool me like that. Stumbled upon a memorial at the intersection of Hamilton Avenue. Finally, someone showed those fuckers their place. Jack and Joe's little village. That's not all, Hakon. Sophie and Barney's hideout was attacked. It could be peacekeepers. Fuck. I'm heading there. Remember what you're here for, Aiden. We were supposed to get into the central loop and not get involved in local conflicts. Don't get involved in this. Go back to the metro. We will share what we have with Aitor, and maybe he will let us pass. I have to go, Hakon. I promised to help Sophie. Besides, that's the only way to get to the truth. Okay. I'll be in touch. Sophie? God, Sophie, report in.
This is Aiden. Your men are dead. Oh, shit. Oh, damn it, Aiden. I was actually starting to like you. You brought the peacekeepers here. I helped you. You betrayed us. And now we have to kill you. Helped Aitor and yourself. Helping us was just a byproduct. What are you waiting for? Don't know what to do? You figures. <sighs> Hmm. <sighs> 
Find Barney. <laughs> Where did you come from? I've got a sixth sense, kid. I knew you were gonna get in trouble. Barney wanted to kill you. Means he has something to hide. Something about Lucas, or worse. What do you mean? The murder of the commander. Now the takeover of the water tower. That's no coincidence, Aiden. Barney has long been looking to get out from behind his sister's shadow and rid Villador of the peacekeepers himself. I'll try to find him. Be careful. I'll go warn Eitor. Let's keep in touch. I didn't think the idiot had it in him. You have to find him. Youth can be a miracle, but it can also be a curse. Barney, come out. Come on, man. I will find you. Aiden, if you rest nicely, I'll shoot you in the head. And if not, you'll spend a long time dying until you turn. So, you'll be the one dying, Barney. You're supposed to stop him, not kill him. Give me the weapon. Give it to me, brother. <sighs> Hope you know what you're doing. So this is the thanks I get for helping? Death is how we thank traitors. You didn't say you were working for Aiden. I don't work for Aiden, I work for myself. No one can remain neutral in this, Aiden. We're fighting for survival. Without water, the whole bazaar will die in under a month. And the peacekeepers, they won't help us. Just like when my mother died. They just sat and watched us die. Turns out, you're one of them. You don't care about us. Tell me, why should I not kill you? Sophie, shoot! What are you waiting for? Because we can help each other. Who killed Lucas? He thinks we killed him. Sophie, talk to me. Did you do it? No. Sophie, what the hell? Why do you care about this murderer? What did Ator promise you? Ator promised me passage to the center. That's why I'm helping him. And you believe him? Just like that? At least he didn't try to kill me. He wasn't the one you betrayed. But I can help you too. Help us with the water, 
And I'll take you to the Central Loop myself. Okay, first, I did not betray you. I'm helping investigate a murder, and that's different. As for your offer, isn't the only way through controlled by the PK? There is another way. Do you really believe that I'd just trust you again? We need each other. You didn't tell us you were working with the PK, so we made assumptions. Things are getting more dangerous, and we all need to be careful. You tried to kill me, Sophie. I swear on the memory of Bertie, Susie, Logan, Ralph, and Herman, I'm sure. If you help us, we'll take you to the center. Will you help? Fine. What's the plan? Jack and Joe escaped. We have a chance to take the tower and finally reclaim the water. Poor fucking Ator does. We'll deal with the peacekeepers and getting you to the center immediately afterwards. First, we need to secure access to water. How do I get up the tower? It's almost impossible without a winch, and Joe's men sealed off access. That's why I'm asking you. So you want me to climb it? If you do, you'll save a great many people, Aiden. We won't forget this. It's taller than I thought.
Sophie, Jack and Joe are in the tower. They're gonna blow it up. Dear God. If they do, we will have no water source. Come on, Aiden. The tower is mine. Try to disarm the charges. Supposed to take tribute, just collect money. Jack, give it back. They'll get what they deserve. They will die. Jack, I'm warning you. after all. Either the bizarre jag holes or the PK. They'll be on us the moment we come down from here, buddy. Fuck, we lost it, man. We lost it. We can't find everything. That's why it's time for fireworks. Nobody's getting out alive. Joe, I don't want to die, you asshole. Hey, who's there? Stop, or we'll blow the goddamn tower, I swear.
I dare you. I know you won't do it. Don't listen to him, Jack. It's over. Fuck it up! I don't know. I'm scared. Joe, wait. Joe, hey, isn't that the pilgrim who showed up at the bazaar recently? Maybe. Pilgrim or Pope. So what? Don't you get it? If he's a pilgrim, he can get us out. Lead us out of the city to someplace safe. I don't trust that fucker. You don't trust anyone! I told you to play nice with Barney when we had the chance! Fucking listen to me for once! Well, play nice with Barney? What for? To make him get the fuck out of the bazaar! After what we found out from the peacekeepers. We tipped off the fucker, gave him a chance to run. But he thought he was too clever for that. They warned Barney. About what? Well, about Lucas wanting to take him in on weapons charges, among others. He'd been set a trap for him for weeks. And instead of politely getting the fuck out of here, he tried to play cute instead. So, Barney knew Lucas was after him. The moron wanted to start a war in old Villador. And you ask me, war's the last thing we need. Money, crystals, that's a different story. That's why I tried to put an end to that rabbit dog and his sister. So, Pilgrim, will you get us out of the city or what? Calm down, Joe. I won't fucking calm down. Get us out of the city, Pilgrim. To the nearest safe settlement. And no one will die here. I don't bargain with extortionists and murderers. Well now, look at the saint. The pilgrim wants to preach to us. Oh, you fucking fool. Do it, Jack. Now. Goodbye, Bazaar. What? What happened? Your toys don't work? You... you did this? You... <laughs> So what now, Aiden? Smart guy. Who gets control of the water?
Sophie and her men near the water tower. Seems they wanted to look into the water situation with Carl. So the place should be empty now. But I don't know when they'll be back. Is this some kind of collector or what? Hmm, that ain't no proof. Here's something. Hey, what the hell? Oh, fuck! That's... That's human skin! Hakon, I found the tattoo they cut out of Lucas. Damn freaks. What? Yeah. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Get the hell out of there! We still ain't Norrin. Why are you going through my sister's stuff? Didn't know they were hiring pilgrims as housekeepers in this hole. Are you shedding skin, Barney? What the fuck is... We didn't... A little piece of Lucas to remember him by, you sicko. Fuck you. Nice try. But that ain't mine. I'll kill you, you son of a bitch! <sighs> She wasn't here. Anywhere for a good couple of hours. Do, do you know what it means? He wanted to show off. Son of a bitch wanted to prove that he killed Lucas. So you're a cannibal now or some shit, Barney? It, it wasn't me! It's him! He framed me! Okay, we're taking him to the station. He'll give us the whole story soon enough.
You did good, Aiden. Meet me in my office. Time to fulfill my end of the deal. Where'd you get the idea? Your sick head? Or from your little sister? Fuck you! I hated the guy more than most. But even I'm not stupid enough to have killed him. You know, whenever I catch someone, even red-handed, they deny it till the very end. Maybe you are stupid enough to have done that. Maybe you're a moron, even. <laughs> you're trying to piss me off, so I kill you right here. No, no, no. That's not my game. You're going to be tried and convicted. So you kill Lucas. What happens next? I don't know, asshole. Because I didn't do it. Hurt me, and I'll take revenge. But I'm not a cold-blooded killer. Forget it, Aiden. Punks like him just want to cause chaos, their favorite flavor. We're done here. This idiot won't tell the truth. Why would I lie less to gain by lying to you than I did if I'd killed Lucas? Which I didn't. Don't expect rational thought from anyone who needs a separate brain just to control his sphincter. You're the one talking out of his asshole. Give me a fucking break. This piece of skin is evidence. Solid evidence. Let's not waste any more time on this piece of garbage, Aiden. He'll get a trial, followed by a death sentence soon enough. What about our agreement? It still stands. Go to the metro tunnels. I'll meet you there after we've disposed of Barney. But there's one more thing. I need a favor. <coughs> well? Once you get to the center, my wife and kids are there. Will you give them something for me? And tell them that I'm safe? You don't have anyone you trust more to handle this for you? Maybe I don't. As long as this isn't arsenic and you're not setting me up. It's not. Your dress is on it. I'm outside the tunnel that leads to the car factory. And the entrance is closed. I'll climb up and try entering from the roof. Be careful. Waltz is extremely dangerous. I know. I'll try and open the gate. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, Ader. Yeah, it worked. I'm inside. Ader? I'm inside. Okay, we're almost there. Look around for generators. The military always brought them for backup power. Get a generator working and the gate should open. That's just what I needed. Okay, Hepa, Wuba, check the other exit and head down the tunnel. Walls should be close. Okay, we're doing this. Good job, soldier. Ader, Ader. The metro base, it, it, it's under attack. It's the bazaar. What the fuck? Gotta get the power back on. Probably blew a fuse. There must be a fuse box here somewhere. Hey! Come on. Fuck me, what a mess. 
Try to find it. There should be a utility room nearby. I told you to stay outside. You're not the fucking commander. Gentlemen, Waltz might be here. Focus, for fuck's sake. We're waiting, Aiden. If you're gonna screw up now, you picked a bad time. The fuse box, Aiden. I don't like just hanging out here. Find the fuse box, because I'm getting nervous. <laughs> Can someone else go? This dude clearly doesn't know what he's doing. Find that fuse box, dude. I'm through it already. You have anything? There are some wires, but it's all flooded. This doesn't look good, Lieutenant. The equipment's been shut down for 15 years. Keep looking. Hopefully that's not the reason for the short circuit. Someone was here. They yanked out the cord. Somebody's in here. It's him! Get him! Easy now. Surround him. Still on Jack Matt's leash? Save it for your trial, just before they cut your head off. Do you really think that's how this is going to play out, Lieutenant? Lucas's death was just the beginning. You admit you had him killed. Take him. Why does his death bother you? You're not enjoying your new role? New status, new challenges, new possibilities. Don't I deserve a thank you for making this possible? Good. Now enough of your crap. Cuff him, Hepper. I'm glad you finally joined us. Shut up, now, what? give back what you stole from me. Give back the key, boy, or you will all die. Fuck! Hepper! Hey, 
for what you've done? A little boy wants to pretend he's a grown-up, but he's no grown-up, just a precious little boy. What's happening to me? Uh, what happened here? Where are you? I'm in the car factory. Over. The key. Walt has the GRE key. This is it, Waltz. I'm coming for you.
Ricky. You? I already killed you once. This time, I'll do it right. You're one of my curious. Good. Before I kill you, you'll get a chance to witness something spectacular. Everything comes full circle. We return to the beginning. And now, you will witness history in the making. A history? Five years old! You thought you kids! We were kids! You were part of something greater. You owe it to me that you are still alive. That you are stronger than others, special. That you are stronger than I could have imagined. Yet not as strong as me. Any last words? What have you done to my sister? Sister? What have you done to me? Aiden, you're alive. <laughs> Run! Uh, we got it. We got it. Run! to Aiden. Man, we were just a million miles away. Do you have nightmares about what he did to us? All the time. That's why I want to kill the fucker. Waltz is number three on my list. Wait, you got a hit list? <laughs> Seriously? Do I look like I'm kidding? The city's got a lot of trash, and I'm the maid who's gonna make it the capital of cleanliness. Uh, who else is on it? Besides Waltz, Butcher, hack on, and you know what? It's a very long list. There's a few small fries that deserve a bolt between the eyes as well. And by whose authority are you doing this? <laughs> you kidding me? 
the highest court of justice in the land. My own noble authority, your honor. And you? What were you doing with that bastard Hakon? How did you know I knew him? Who do you think shot him when you were romancing each other in the cabin? So, what's your link with him? You'll have a hard time believing this, but he saved my life. When I came to town, I was infected. Yeah, no biomarker. People at the bazaar wanted to hang me. Sure, I'd do it myself. But he got me out of there. Got me a biomarker. Can't believe he duped me. He dupes everyone. Like everyone. I trusted him once, too. Really? Tell me about it. Maybe someday. But my story is similar to yours. He tricked me. And people died. Better forget about him. Or do like me. When you see him next, make sure you have a crossbow and a bunch of bolts handy. Okay, enough chatting. Let's go. <laughs> Bossy. I like that. We gotta go. Yeah, I'm coming. Wow. I thought you were gone. Apparently, Waltz was doing these experiments on the sly. Fucking psycho. But, and no one in the GRE noticed? At some point, they did. I heard that's why they kicked him out. Too bad it was too late. I was hoping you were a little faster. And Hakon, why is he on the list? Because he killed Lucas? No. I like those blue puppets, the PKs. But no, I don't give a shit about Lucas's death. And why then? That, my dear, is a long story for another day. Let's just say everyone on that list deserves a headshot. And Hakon deserves something worse. Fuck! This was always open. We're locked out. <sighs> Fucking great! This is a GRE facility, isn't it? Dylan? How do you know Dylan? <laughs> no is an overstatement. He contacted me because he wanted to escape the city and waltz. He was frightened. Something must have happened, or he found something. What could he have found? I don't know. He knew I was in touch with Frank, but then Dylan just disappeared, stopped making contact. Well, Dylan gave me this before he died. Waltz killed him. Fucking... So he got him after all. Also, Dylan told me to find someone named Lawan. You know who that is? Maybe we were meant to meet each other. The universe brought us together for some fucked up reason. What? I am Lawan. Dylan wanted to contact Frank. He said the PK commander, Lucas, found something. Something Waltz had been looking for for a long time. He wanted to escape the city so that Waltz wouldn't get it. The GRE key? I have it now. <laughs> Probably. Lucas died because of this gizmo. Dylan, too. Watch out. Or you'll be next. It's valuable. Waltz? Invaluable, I suppose. So you'd better not lose it. Look out! Well, what's going on? Impossible. Waltz must have switched on the generators. But Waltz, but why? Don't have a clue. Who knows what's in that fucker's head? Come on. <sighs> Hurry, before they go off. The train is The metro service is sorry for Please mind the gap. Thank you for your attention. You're fucking welcome. Hurry, Eden. Seems we have a clear path to the central loop.
Ladies and gentlemen, the train is delayed. The Metro service is sorry for any inconvenience. Please mind the gap. Thank you for your attention. Sightseeing. <laughs> Funny. Ugh, fuck. <laughs> Look! Lights here too? It's fucking unbelievable! Oh, come up to the roof! We'll check it from above! See you at the top! Come to lead us to heaven! I was wrong. Can't see shit. I really thought it'd work. You were fucking duped. Uh, well, um... At least it's peaceful. Yep. That's why I come here when I'm pissed off. So a lot, believe me. Look! Aiden! They're back on! They're fucking coming back on! You see that, Aiden? You see that? It's beautiful! Oh, I can't believe it! No, I just can't believe it! <laughs> Danyar. I'm at a lookout point, and it's quite the show. How's this happen? Dark as hell for 15 years, and suddenly this? I don't know. Don't know. But we need to find out. Then drop by the canteen and let's talk. Been missing you like last year's snow, Loka. While shotgunning beers and screwing bartenders. You know me. It's a gift. <laughs> we'll meet you there, dumbass. We see something's wrong. No. Oh, no, 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 fuck, what the hell's going on? So that's the fish eye, okay, how do we get there? The fish eyes gotta wait. You gotta wait, but why? We need to check the substations, one's over there, level with the PK tower. What about the fish eye? Listen, I want to help you, and I will help, we'll do this together. But you have to understand, it's the first it's been the same situation for over 10 years. 10 years of this fucking darkness. We gotta check this out. How do we get to the substation? It's an old paraglider. It'll help you get to places you normally can't reach. Just follow me. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, fuck. <laughs> it's easier than it looks. I still can't believe this is happening. I think Walt's turned the power on somehow. But why would he do that? He's never helped anyone. Why would he give people power back? Are you sure it was him? 
He used the GRE key in the car factory. I think that's when everything lit up. That makes sense. Years ago, the military took over the plant to secure the energy cells on the hills. But I had no idea they could still be made to work and power half the city. Keep an eye on that key, Aiden. Hell knows what else can be done with it. We better hurry to the substation. Here. <laughs> Way better, Aid. But you have to control the wind. Otherwise, it controls you. Okay, from here, it's not far at all to the substation. Go there and activate it. On my own? <laughs> You're a big boy. You'll figure it out. There's another one near the metro. I'll check that one. If we get one or both of these working, means we can activate all of them. Hey, but how do I activate it? It's not rocket science, Aiden. Those are old systems. I guess we need to make sure fuses and cables are working. Paraglider. Can it be made to fly faster? Possibly. But that's something you should ask the craftmaster about.
Nightrunner's favorite. You're a Nightrunner? Me? Nightrunner? <laughs> I wish. They were really something, Aiden. Real heroes. The only thing I had in common with them was substance abuse. But maybe someday. <laughs> Seen any signs of renegades around here? See, Private? Now calm down and let Aglot think. What's there to think about? Why not head back to base? Who the heck are you, anyway? I'm someone offering to help. I'll check what happened to the power. You know anything else about it? That's top secret military information. We're trying to figure out how to get up there. Just go ahead and tell him everything, why don't you? Every last detail. Well, what's the big secret, huh? We need to get this piece of shit working, that's what. My colleague's vastly oversimplifying things, but his gist is correct. There are obvious signs of the electricity having returned, and this here appears to be a substation. It and others like it are capable of transmitting electricity throughout the city. We have orders to get this building functioning once more. Meaning, turn it back on. Unfortunately, without climbing equipment, access to it is severely limited. I can climb up there without the equipment. You'd be willing to do that? You'd be doing a great favor for the peacekeeper. Uniform! The class! Electricity! Breaks all the lights up! Just rare! What was that he said? I think it was something about his mother and a goat. PK morons! We'll be taking that electricity! Thank you very much! Kill him! What about you, bud? Who taught you how to fight like that? Name's Aiden. Hey, you guys know this one? What do the bullets say to the man that got shot? Just passing through. Yeah! <laughs> you severed his limbs with a machete, Nitaf. Technically speaking, that's a melee weapon. While bullets are reserved for... I'm glad you're fine, too. You still want to climb up there, Aiden? Not for free, of course. 
we reward specialists fittingly. I don't have time like now. If you need any help up there, give us a holler over the radio. Aglot's good with electronics. However, from here, I can estimate the level of damage done to the apparatus. Aglot's got a knack for electronics. I thought you were gonna climb up there. I'm inside. How's it look? Somebody was in a big hurry when they took it offline. I would surmise the main circuit suffered a break. Find a cable and connect the source of power to the transmitter. That should restore the circuit. Plugged it in. What now? Activate the control unit. It's in the control room. On my way. Your help is an important contribution to make this city safer. I just wanted to say that so you feel appreciated and so you understand how important this is. Okay. Thank you. I guess. Don't act so surprised. <laughs> Just yanking your chain. Meet me back at the canteen. This could be the start of something beautiful. <laughs> 